Hello and welcome back everyone to Amazing Cultivation Simulator. Where are we at? James has just had a breakthrough. Now he's worshipping. Oh, he's at the grave. Okay, that's fair. Uh, he's currently on balance. That's fine. His breakthrough hasn't allowed him to get any new stuff. I don't need him to take any of these right now, so that's all good. Yes, because unfortunately Karen was mauled by a bear last time. Um, the bear tore her torso apart, leading to its destruction, and she died. Uh, Ball Boy is also here in a trance. Um, I'm guessing that he's been possessed by a spirit, because we just have these graves out here and netting to make them like better. It does say they're still slightly auspicious, so they're not actually negative. Burying attackers will raise good. You can demolish the grave without consequences. We bury our enemies. We are not barbarians. I'm not burying my enemies. They're used for fertilizer. Oh yeah, I have uh, my friend Sorrel here with me today as well. Uh, she's decided she needs to sit on my lap. Wish I could move graves. Okay. I don't, I'm pretty sure you can use these to get spirits or something later, but we'll figure that out at the time. We have tons of poor material stuff here that could be sorrel no pressing the keys thank you uh, we have tons of poor material stuff here that could be sold we just need a trader to come by but i think i'm just going to leave everyone to do their thing right now uh, it'd be good if james could get stronger again although i don't i don't think he'll actually get stronger again until he gets to golden core um, I don't know if he's ready to try and to get into try and become a golden core yet. So I think we're more just waiting on some of our other guys to break through. I although I have um, Boar Boy working hard, I don't think I actually want to break Boar Boy through until we find another crafter who's half decent. Lee Yan is okay. 19 is not really good though. 30 is pretty good for us. I'm not seeing an elf. Anyone see an elf? I'm not seeing an elf. James, stop cultivating and come up here. Find me this elf. I wish his perception was a bit higher. He doesn't see very far around himself. I can see a pear tree. I'm not seeing an elf though. Oh, does it mean the pear tree? Is the pear tree in this? Is the elf in this pear tree? What if I chop the pear tree down? Can you attack the pear tree? No. What does the elf do? I should have read the pop up. Damn it! I was told to read. Pop I've been told a couple of times by people when I've been getting advice for this game to read pop ups, and I'm still not doing it. Someone, someone, come and chop down this tree. I want rid of this elf. No strange little elves in my area. Actually, I probably shouldn't chop down the tree. I don't know what an elf does. If someone can tell me what an elf does, that'd be great. I'm probably not going to bother looking that one up unless weird things start happening. Uh, I'm going to leave that pop-up there, though. That pear tree definitely has the elf in it. But I don't know what an elf is. <laughs> Yeah, so James is just cultivating. We should probably send James out to find some more uh, minions. Where have we not looked around? can't remember which ones I've been to. I don't think I've been to Mount Baron. I'm going to send James to camp at Mount Baron, and we'll have a look at the map there. Ball Boy really doesn't sleep very much. I swear he's always up working at night. Uh, he's sweeping up for us at the moment, which is good. We really need some more marble. I wonder if there's um, some marble that's easy to get at in the mountains somewhere. So we just need marble ore, not ore, just normal marble that isn't made into bricks. As far as I'm aware, I can't turn bricks back into normal marble, which I can then turn into offcuts. There's a big mountain over here. A lot of iron in it. And some igni. 
be careful mining Igni. We're going to do that during the winter. That would also be the time where it's most useful because we'll probably need to use some Igni to heat things up. James has just left. We need to start our agency at Mount South as well. We need someone who... So what are we looking for? When we're looking for a mortal right now, we're looking for someone with good battle and social. So because then they could do the agency. We're looking for somebody with good stats and key sense. Or we're looking for a good crafter. Those are the things that we need. Can't believe I chopped down the giant tree. What a noob. Yeah, we have three open beds still as well, so we can get another three people. Pretty sure I have a max size of 12. I don't remember where I see that, though. Rules? No, it's not under rules, not under laws. I swear it was under sect. Oh, it's here. Here we go. Yeah, max of 12. Currently, we have eight. Does the dog count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, the dog doesn't count. So yeah, we can get another four people, which is quite a lot for us at the moment. I hope James can find us uh, some good disciples at Mount Baron. Who didn't Eric have decent social? He's actually got decent battle. Actually, Eric would be good for our agency. He's got decent battle and decent social. I'm gonna have Eric go to Mount South and start our agency. I think that's how this, that's how this works. Shrine. So we are the Heavenly Foundation sect. What is this going to be? I think this is going to be a temple. That's kind of heavenly. Um, this will be... Oh... How many characters can I put in here? There we go. The Core Foundation Temple. Eric is about to be ancient. Do you want to give them resources in case of an emergency? No. I don't have anything to give him. <laughs> don't worry, Eric. You'll be fine. Off you go now. You were, we're giving you an important job here. You will never become a cultivator. But I think that's... Uh, I did tell you to work hard. Your key sense is 20. But actually getting an agency is more important, arguably, because that will get us more and better um, new disciples going forward. James here yet? No, he's not. Now, does anyone know? Does um, I know obviously certain things happen on certain days which unlock n access to new things. Am I fairly safe as long as I don't let my sec reputation go up too quickly? Is it, or is it like going to get to day 100 and then suddenly bad things are going to start happening? Obviously, things like this elf here. I know this wouldn't occur in like the first 30 days, and we've had those other weird creatures appear. Um, I know stuff like that will only happen after so much time has passed. Hey, there we go. Assign an agency to a disciple for the first time. So that means Eric should have arrived. Oh no, cancel a signing. He's building the main hall, so we've got to wait. Uh, we should be able to go in here with James though. Mount Baron. Don't think I've been here. Okay, there's four cultivators on the map. That doesn't really matter too much though. I'm actually here looking for mortals. So it's not like we have a bad reputation. We don't have a particularly bad. Um, nobody hates us a lot, so I shouldn't be attacked by anyone. You, you any good? Oh damn! Social good, battle good, key sense is fine. Your stats are actually all right. I wouldn't mind recruiting you. Hello. Just talk to me. Who ping? You're predestined to become my disciple. 
Okay. Interested in... Oh, that's somebody I don't know about. If they're unaffiliated, I probably don't know anything. Oh, you know something about Wang Zing from the 100 Insect Mountain place? Uh, did you say you know his favourites? Yeah, there we go. Okay, we learned something. Tell me something you want to know about. Have you seen He Thou Dao from the palace? Um, I do. That's some points. Oh, you're actually, you have no guard. I just realized. Oh, wow. I can get, I can get you right up. Hey, cool. So, Fu Ping is going to visit us now, which means we can recruit him. So, that's one of four. Fu Ping is an alright person to have, I think. By the way, can I see his um, crafting? Oh, his crafting's good. Fu Ping is just all around good. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. But he can basically fill any role. Hello. Are you any good? Key sense is okay. Other than that, it's all oh, that looks good. Look is the only thing that you can't really get up. But you also have other issues. I'm not a fan of you, Du Quing. Okay, let's have a look. Are you? You you have good crafting. I might want to bring you all along for the crafting. You're pa just pants. Uh, crafting, crafting, crafting. Level 13, so we're getting up 7 more. Uh, what would that bring him to? 41. He would be alright for... We'd, we couldn't get him super high. 41 is really good though for, for us right now. I'm going to see if I can get this guy. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Fish. No. Kids. No. Tell me something you want to know about. I know something favourites of Fu Ping. Oh, well, you might as well. I might as well try and get that information. Fu Ping. Oh, Fu Ping's the person I've already got, but I could still maybe use that. There we go. Do you know anything else? Don't think you do. Have you seen Li Filu from Kunlun? I do not know anything about them. What about you? Um, I've heard news of personal treasure of Shikan from Demonic. Demonibida? You said you knew personal treasure. But you're not going to tell me. I just realised this person's guard seems to be down as well. I'll tell you this. Yep. And this. Yep. What are you on now? 53. I need something more. Um, can I just tell you about some random person? There we go. 160. Act. Invite. Cool. That's another person. We need two more. Uh, return, leave. Uh, you, you, oh no, I think you were pants, weren't you? Yeah, you are kind of pants. You, you any good? You have a sword. Your stats are poo, your key sent, yeah, you're just bad. No, not interested. You? Ooh, wow, look at that battle. Your stats are, your key sense is not good. Which, but I can't, with the battle and their stats, I kind of want to try and make this person a cultivator. The stats are not bad. Failing that, they could mine for us. Oh, if only your key sense was higher. I'm sure that's something we can get up. You know what, you, you will do. Come here. Join me. Together we'll rule the world. There you go. I'll tell you some random crap. 
Do you want to hear about this random person? Of course you do. There we go. Oh, no. Wait. Come back. And invite. Cool. And now we need one more. Just clearing out all the decent people in this village. You, you any good? Oh, I didn't look at your stats. Whoops. Hi, Predestiny. I don't actually know what Predestiny means. Um, your stats are acceptable. Your battle's good. Your key sense is alright. Oh, you look at your medicine. You could be a healer. Yeah, you'll do. And that will get us up to 12 out of 12 people. And then we tell you some random crap. And you love us for giving you this information about people you don't know. Oh, you don't actually care about that one. Okay, fair enough. I stand corrected. But you did care about that one. What about this one? You care about this one too. There we go. Invite. And there we go. That's four out of four. So we will now have a full sect once all those people have turned up. Now let's have a quick look around the area. Just so we can unfog the map a bit. I don't know if I gain anything from unfogging the map. I know obviously you can find things. Maybe there might could be a demon beast here we could kill. I mean it's unlikely to be a demon beast and next to their cotton fields. This is a fairly small map. I swear James can see further when he's somewhere other than our sect. Ooh, what's in here? Demon beasts? Shouldn't really be looking for demon beasts. Oh, hello. Yeah, there is one. <laughs> Hello, how strong are you? You technically should be weaker than James, but everyone is weaker. Everyone is stronger than James. We've learned that. So we will use the puppy dog to begin the combat. And now that they are engaged, James can get involved as well. And this should be a fairly simple win for us. Do I want to use James's key? He doesn't need to use his key. We're definitely going to win, or we should definitely win without him having to do anything. And again, I kind of want to be confident in that, so let's just uh, smash it with a spell. There we go. Do a ton of key damage. There's some earth, uh, stone essence here. Don't know how hard it is to get. Often used for making high-end decorations and medicine, so maybe we should pick up that stone essence while we're here. Can I? Let's speed this up, shall we? And yeah, we've definitely won this. Def I probably didn't even need to use that spell. No, I almost certainly didn't. So we can take stuff off this thing's corpse. Hopefully. Uh, last time I knocked out a rabbit, I couldn't... Uh, I wasn't sure. Could I finish it? I might have just been being retarded at that time. I might need to still kill it because it was only unconscious. I think that might have been the case. I can't remember if I checked to see if I had the option or not. Cool. Rabbit down. It's flopped. James, finish it off. Boom. Rabbit down. Butcher it. And now we have some more beast blood to set things on fire. And we also have the hide, which is the more important bit. I'm assuming beast blood is useful later on. I'm also going to collect the stone essence. And we'll see if there's anything else of value here. I think we're good there.
no 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 let's not go near that one last time we went near something that big it killed us or nearly killed us it badly hurt james and we couldn't actually beat it with a dog either okay note to self there is a big scary in the top left corner of this map Cool, uh, so Romulus has got better at social, the elf is still here. Also, the elf is supposedly, yeah, it's still there. The green glow is still there. Nothing, this hasn't set on fire for a while, which is good. And uh, we're waiting for those people we've invited to turn up, and then I guess we just need to cultivate, really. I don't know if there's anything important I should be doing with the sect at this point. We've built all the main things. We could certainly improve some bits of it. I still don't have an ancestor shrine, which I still don't, I don't actually know what this does. Let's just build one. I'm going to put it here. Don't know what it does. Um, does it have... Wait. Spirit stone ancestor shrine. Let's not do that first. Um, I've lost it. Sect. Ancestor shrine. Let's uh, build it out of iron like normal people. And at this point, I feel like we just need to be trying to get our cultivators up. Okay. Does anyone know what this does? Somebody said it's important, but nobody knows why. Room should be facing south. Um, this is only useful after you have ascended at least one to site. Okay. Okay, so apparently this thing isn't helpful to us at this point. But everyone's going to come and pray at it. Um, let's build ourselves a little room around it, shall we? It's an ancestor shrine, so it deserves a big fancy room. This even? One, two, three, one, two, three, yep. Ah, oh, but it's only going to get a single door. There we go, did I... Yeah, there's a marble wall going there. We are going. We do need uh, to actually put the flooring down still, though, which we need normal marble for. In fact, it's daytime. I can see better. Can we find any marble? It's dark steel. We should probably get that at some point. In fact. Pretty sure dark steel is fairly valuable, so I'm just going to tell people to grab those bits. Ice crystal, another bit of dark steel, grab that. How good is jade? I kind of want to build some out of jade. We have a severe lack of marble, though. I wish I could turn the marble bricks into flooring. Ice crystal. We got all the mar there was marble in this, which we all mined, which we mined all of out. No, it looks like we're pretty stuffed as far as marble con is concerned, by the look of it. We have had oh, there's a box here. We looks like we've had all the marble on the uh, on the map, unless this box contains marble. That'd be amazing if it does. Oh yeah, how's our agency coming along? Still being built. I imagine that looks like it'll take a little while, probably a couple of days. We're building up our shrine here though. So apparently this isn't actually useful until later. But it's a nice building. Okay, something... Does this use... Okay, it does use offcuts. I was, if um, I could use bricks for roofs, I was tempted to... What about these roofs? No, still off cuts. I was tempted to re roof everything with marble rather than using um, wood for it. Oh my god, it actually had marble in it. 
the uh, the box up here, it actually had marble in it. Now we can... Okay, all of that's getting turned into offcuts before I accidentally do use it for something else. Repeat 50 times, go. Um, I don't have anything else trying to use the marble right now, I don't think. I'm going to make this a fancy room. But uh, we need we need to actually put the flooring down first before I bother trying to do much more with that, I think. How are we doing with our training? Yan Lee will be ready to ascend soon. Oh, if only the stats were better. There is a fire. Why am... Oh, wait, no. What? What's... Oh, it's the beast blood. Okay, they brought the beast blood back. That's why there's a fire here. Yeah, James has just gone straight back to cultivating, which is fine. If we get him to Golden Core, we will be safe. We could then get the sect up to the next reputation. We still need to be careful, though, because any time he was out, we would be at risk of being attacked by someone we couldn't deal with. Oh, a stranger is injured. Are you actually any good? Um, I'm not really interested in you, honestly. No, banish, be gone. The the four people I recruited from um, Mount whatever it is, Mount Baron, are all better than you. What we could actually, oh no, wait, I want a better crafter first. I was gonna say something we could do is make um, some clothes, some clothes out of the beast hide. We have quite a bit of that now. That's sixty. Um, I'm not sure if that's included if the other bits been brought over. No, yeah, 60. However, um, 30 crafting skill isn't amazing. We could probably get that higher. Got a bit more flooring put down. Oh, yeah, because we have a, a, a fire. Fire's been put out. James is working incredibly hard, practicing his spells. Not that he's any good at spells. Zero spell ability. But to be fair, that's, I guess that's because I haven't put anything in here. If I put one in here, will that make a big difference to how good he is at doing spells? Because that actually... What's this one again? Oh, formation. So that doesn't matter so much. If we made him better at doing spells, that would make him a lot more effective. Oh, okay, Mount South is ready. So we can have no policy or charity. Use, uh, give things to people who need them. Different problems will come up and need to be handled. You can gain a small amount of followers, appeal, or influence. I guess we'll go with charity. So, we now have this thing. I got to this point at one point before, I think. Uh, the Core Foundation Temple. Pay close attention to this place, which increases the frequency of policy events, but also doubles the cost. No, let's not do that. Population of followers increases via different policy events. The higher the appeal, the more the increased followers. Without any policy, the region will lose five followers every day, which is why we've just selected charity. So daily, we make ten influence here. Um, we have some storage we can claim. This is the main hall upgrade it and that will yield us more influence I imagine we need brownstone and wood well, th those things wouldn't be hard to get influence though we would need to wait okay so we can oh I see these are all the these are the areas on each that makes sense so we can build a thing at each of the areas I seem to remember you can only build on so many of these. You can't do all of them. Do we need wood? Not particularly. Do we need wheat? Not particularly. What's a dojo do? And then we have... Is that brownstone? Yes. And that's more wheat. I kind of want to build the dojo. Let's start with that. 
And then I guess having a source of food would be good. If we have the source of wood as well, that'll counteract us ever needing to do... We'll never need to actually go out of our way to gather wood. So Yeah, and then that locks those. So I could can if I just cancel that, then we can see the brownstone, not important, and we're already getting food. Yeah, I'm really not interested in brownstone, so I'd rather have the wood. Oops. Um, so, yeah, put the logging camp in. And then once all those are done, we will start getting things and stuff. Yes. Um, Eric could be better. <laughs> um, however, he will do for now. Uh, you can add disciples to help him, which then boosts the stats. Um, as we move forward, we will do that. What I'll probably do is, as we get uh, better disciples, we'll throw the old ones at the agencies. They can go and run the agencies for us. Nice getting all this sorted. Oh yeah, we can... We're having four more people come, but I think we only have three beds. So, I want a couple more marble bedrooms. I can fit them in here. And then random marble flooring here. Cool, that's all good. Uh, apparently we're under attack. Let's see. We have two women. Neither of them are armed, so I'd hardly call this an attack. But they seem to think they're attacking us. Uh, one has a battle skill of 10. And the other one has a battle skill of 17. So, Doggo can just go and eliminate both of them. And then they can fertilize our crops. Get them, Doggo. How dare they attack us. You're not doing very well at hitting her. There we go, that's one. That's two. Are they alive? Nope, that's dead. You're about to die. Search. Search. Right, can you just finish this person off so that I can tell people to move them? There we go. Now they're a corpse. And uh, now we can say... Move one of them to the wheat field. And uh, move one of them over to the trees. One thing we could do, we could look at expanding our farm. Let's make sure everyone has stuff to do, shall we? Let's clear out all of this. And clear out these bits as well. Mainly want to clear out the fertile bit up here, though. And we're going to greatly expand our farming. James, why are you mentally unstable? Go have a, like, a drink or something. Alcohol will sort you out. Um, and on that note, I think we'll end it there. Thank you for watching. This has been the Heavily Foundation Sect. Our sect is finally growing into something worthy of respect, I feel. Um, we currently don't even have a single golden core. Uh, but we are working on getting more people that can actually cultivate now. Rather than just having James do all the work. And... We are also building up our agency, which will be good. How long till these start producing stuff? Not long, really. This is building very quickly. Uh, so we don't have a source of brownstone to upgrade the main hall, but I don't think that's going to be too hard to sort out. How much brownstone do I have? 200. If we mine out a bunch of the crap on the map, which we could just tell the people to do now, if we mine out these areas, we'll have a ton more brownstone. And that will also free up more areas for building. So we have a lot of really crappy miscellaneous labor for our outer disciples to do now. No more building fancy structures. Now they need to go and mine and uh, pick up weeds.
and then we'll get some farming going as well. All that for next time though. For now, thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Do those things. Don't do those things. Um, it's up to you. But hopefully I'll see you next time. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.